Now to that daycare tragedy in Florida. Police say a baby has died her being left inside a van for five hours. And now the co-owner of the daycare is under arrest. This morning, tragedy at this daycare in Jacksonville, Florida. Police say a four month old died after being left in the back of a van for several hours. Preliminary information suggests that the kid was there from uh, about 8 a.m. to about a little after 1 o'clock p.m., so almost five hours. Temperatures during the afternoon reached 92 degrees. Authorities say an employee called 911 after finding the baby in the van, which is used to pick up children who attend the daycare. Overnight, police arrested the co-owner of the business. Daryl Ewing is now charged with child neglect. We had to stop sending them there. The business has faced complaints in the past. This woman, who didn't want to be identified, says she recently pulled her kids out of that daycare. They were left on the same exact daycare van. Luckily, they were grade school age and could get themselves off. It comes just days after a similar tragedy was averted near Atlanta, where officers rescued this child left in a hot vehicle outside Walmart. The father now under arrest. The death in Florida would be the eighth hot car death so far this year, coming after a record 52 last year. Aside from crashes, heat stroke is the leading cause of death in vehicles for children. On the same day of that tragedy in Florida, an Ohio lawmaker proposed legislation that would require all vehicles be equipped with the system to alert the driver if a passenger is still in the back seat when the car is turned off. And the license of that daycare in Florida has now been suspended. Authorities say it failed to notify the state that it was transporting children in that van.